screening checkpoints that you follow before the manuscript goes to peer reviewers? So the initial screening before it's even assigned to an editor would be conducted by my staff. Um, and what they're looking for is technical aspects of the manuscript. Does it have a title page, a cover letter? Does it have an abstract, a precy? Um, is the body of the manuscript structured in the way that we request? A few other things that we're looking for, though, are um, if it's a randomized control trial, has it been registered? Was it registered prospectively in a clinical trials registry prior to um, enrolling the first patient? And if it was not enrolled, if it was not registered prior to patient enrollment, that's, that's the end of the manuscript for us right there. Uh, so there are some um, things like that, some policy things like that that we might look at. But my staff is not looking at the English language and how well it's written at that point. When it's assigned to the editor, it's the editor, I think, who is looking at it at that point, And that's where that judgment may come in. And at that point, they may decide that they're, they don't, they're not going to even send it out for peer review because it is something that's, it could be just out of the scope of the journal, it could be so poorly written that it can't move on. Um, so those types of things they would look at. Um, what we do at our journal is if the editor does want to editorially reject something without peer review, we send that manuscript to an editorial board member just for another, again, a second opinion to see if they agree with the editor's judgment. And then it is also it discussed on our Thursday call. Um, the idea of an editorial reject, even though authors don't get a peer review back, the idea is to get them a decision very quickly so that they can take action. Um, you know, maybe they send it to someone to help with English. Maybe they send it to, maybe it's out of the scope of our journal, so they send it to a more specialized journal or something like that. So uh, the goal with that is, uh, is to just um, be respectful of the author's time and get it back to them quickly so they can move on. Um, so yeah, it's really the stage of the editor, the editorial board that's doing that initial screen that might catch something that, uh, especially related to English language, that maybe prohibits it from moving on. Um, but then there are manuscripts that go through peer review that maybe aren't well written at all, and our, our reviewers will comment on that. and editors but sometimes there's something about the science or that's so important that we want to give it a chance and see what happens so